Right, the Albuquerque Christian Children's Home is dedicated to providing the best physical, psychological, and spiritual care for school-aged children who are neglected, abused, or in need of supervision. We're joined this morning by Development Director Britton Pruitt to find out more about the Albuquerque Christian Children's Ministry, um, all that you guys do throughout the community. Uh, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for having me. Absolutely. Okay, so, so to start, though, I want to talk about uh, the children's home. How did it come about and what's the overall mission? The children's home came about by a vision of Joel and Nina Taylor and others and the University Church of Christ back in 1968. We actually opened our doors in 1970 and it came about largely in part because of their vision and the, the ministry that they had in mind. Um, we are a 401c3 nonprofit ministry and uh, Albuquerque Christian Children's Home, we provide long-term foster care for abandoned, neglected, and abused children. We uh, cannot exist without the support of our donors and sponsors because we do not accept any state or federal funds, and so we need donors and sponsors to help support our ministry so we, we can do the mission that we uh, were given. It truly is the village coming together and helping to take care of these children. Absolutely. Yes. Uh, tell me, how many children do you guys currently have um, that you're helping right now? Well, currently we have uh, five uh, children that are belong to one of the house parents. And mm -hmm. so we consider them our children since they do live on campus. And we have six other children that are on campus right now. We can, uh, we can house about 20 children um, max at, at their at current levels that we have right now. So that's, that's, the, that's what we have as far as the... I can only imagine yeah. how uh, hectic the date can possibly be inside that home. Oh, it, but it's... A whole lot of fun, though. It's, I'm sure it is a lot of fun, but it's a lot of work. I mean, mm -hmm. the house parents work really hard, and they, they have a set schedule where we allow them to take time off, but it, it's a fulfilling and rewarding ministry. I'm sure if you ask them, it'd be a fulfilling and rewarding uh, experience for them. Absolutely. You know, I want to express to our viewers at home um, more about the children. No specifics. We want to keep their identity and everything right. um, private. Um, but just tell me about the children in general. How are they when, when they first enter into the home? And how has the home really changed their, their lives and really helped guide them? When our children come to us, sometimes they come to us from CYFD, sometimes they come from travel placement, sometimes they come from private placement. And when the children come to us, uh, most of the time they are not trusting mm -hmm. of us. They have some uh, experiences, obviously, that they've experienced that children shouldn't have to experience. And right. they come to us, they don't trust us. There's uh, things that they're re really leery about. They may not even want to be there because of their circumstances. But the house parents show them godly love. They show them care. They're, they're highly trained be able to uh, help the children through the circumstances that they have. And so when the children, uh, after, after a while that they've been there, they start warming up, they start trusting them, they start um, showing more about who they are. And we just want them to be kids. Right. We just want them to grow up and learn to be kids, and we want to give them the opportunity to do that. Find a sense of belonging, a place where they belong. Y yes, but also where they feel safe. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. I know you guys have an event coming up. Tell me about that. Uh, on August 14th, it's a Saturday from 11 to 2, we're going to have an open house and barbecue, uh, COVID willing. <laughs> and uh, w that's when the community can come out. They can visit one of the cottages. They can meet the house parents. They can talk to them. Um, a lot of the times we have people that will come out and do interviews on the, from, from radio stations. Uh, so we, we do have a lot of... Uh, time that we can be able to Absolutely. spend with the children and, and show people what we're all about. Absolutely. Now I know we're getting a hard wrap here. Give me details of where people can find more details and how they can support you. Where's your website? It's www.accth4kids.org and you can also do the, the, the Backspace Facebook and find us on Facebook. And my, uh, it's, uh, if you want to contact me, it's 505-898-5520 or you can email me at B, the letter B, Pruitt, B-P-R-U-I-T-T, -T, at A-C-C-H, the number four, kids.org. Perfect. Again, thank you so much for joining us. Thank 